My name is Urs Heutschi, I'm from Swiss Enviro, a small private company in Switzerland. We are so supported by the Swiss government to help Swiss SMEs to find uh, customer partners, buyers all over the world. We organize some 10 to 12 Swiss pavilions and this is the first time we are here in Cape Town at the end of uh, 2022. I think the African market is one of the future. There is a lot, especially in the renewable energy. Africa needs a lot of energy to develop. Uh, so the huge opportunities, we have some companies here to tra transform waste into energy or there are a lot of landfill sites which produce gas which also can be transformed to energy. So there's huge potential here. I think the challenges we, s or I personally see is uh, not so much the local challenges but it's a lot of the perception of the African market uh, in Europe. It's not yet recognized as a huge opportunity to invest, to sell, to interact, uh, to cooperate. My name is Toby Lemkonda. I'm the senior consultant for Hitachi Zosen Innova. Our head office is based in Switzerland, um, covering the whole of Africa. I'm based in Pretoria. The opportunities that are there, first of all, we want to clean up the landfills, of which most of them, they've reached their lifespan. And we're producing electricity using the solid municipality waste to produce energy. So basically we don't need like diesel and stuff like that. It's just the good quality of solid waste, then it, we have uh, electricity. The challenges that we are facing in Africa for overall, it's like the waste management itself. We are behind. We still need to do like a lot of campaign to have like more awareness so that people they can understand how the waste is affecting our environment. We have campaigns, we introduce it from the school part of it. We do like go to malls and have like more and more campaigns up until people they understand that waste it is a problem in our country.